Concerns are brewing in one part of Sussex County. A developer is looking to build a microbrewery in West Rehoboth, but not all neighbors wanted to. Good evening. I'm Paul Butler. And I'm Steve Hammond. Welcome to WBOC News at 6. The name Beach Fire Brewing Company may sound familiar. That's the company that proposed a controversial brew pub for a Lewis Church earlier this year. Well, now they are back with another proposal that is turning some heads. They want to build a microbrewery near the intersection of Johnston Road and Central Avenue in West Rehoboth. But as is often the case with these types of projects, not everybody is on board. Our Sussex County Bureau Chief Evan Kozlov joins us in front of this proposed site. Evan, plans are for that warehouse behind you. Right, and Steve, clearly it's not that large of a property. According to the developer, it's just about 1,500 square feet, but it's in a crossroads of sorts. That's because in this direction is the center of West Rehoboth. If you walk with me over there, that's the road that leads to Rehoboth Beach. This is West Rehoboth, an area that, according to neighbors, was once gripped by drug use and poverty. But now the area has been reborn, according to Janet Mall Martin from the Westside New Beginnings Youth Center. She says year by year it is improving, and that's why she's concerned about a proposal for a microbrewery in town. When you're moving forward, you want to make sure that those things that come into your community can add to the community, can help the community to move forward. And today at a public hearing in front of County Council, Mole Martin got a chance to speak her mind. This falls a decision in February by the Planning and Zoning Commission to recommend approval of the project. Developer Harry Metcalf spoke with WBOC after the meeting and tells us that the microbrewery could be an economic boost to the area, bringing tourists to the less visited part of town. Now, this is really the first business that's in West Rehoboth that's actually going to invite the public in to come and see the area. And what our, th our thought is, is that once people see, other businesses see that there's a viable commercial use for these properties where the public can visit, they're going to locate things there. But in the end, the application was deferred for now due to concerns among some on council that there's not enough space for parking. Executive Director of the Youth Center, Brenda Milborn, shares these concerns. Looking at the black top that they have there, you can only put six cars there at a time. I don't believe on that street is the correct place. So no brewing just yet, but it could be here soon in West Rehoboth. As for the delays, Metcalf says it is, of course, frustrating, saying that there's something, quote, fundamentally broken in the system, adding that Sussex County Council needs to be more business friendly. Reporting here in Sussex County, this is Evan Kozloff for WBOC News in West Rehoboth. Evan, thank you. Uh, just a few more details on the microbrewery. They have what's called a three and a half barrel system. That means they can produce a maximum of about 70 half kegs a month. The developers say that's about a tenth of what's allowed of a brew pub. They say most of that beer will be served in-house where there will be for seating up to about 20 people in that part of Sussex County. 